Fuck all these niggas and bitches, they dead to me. I got the sauce, I got the remedy. Say my thought, but act like an enemy. I make a call and turn you to cannon. Not wasting my time, not wasting my energy. Shot for my confidence, shot for a better me. So, last night, the Lakers went up against the Houston Rockets once again, in which LeBron James put on a show, which I knew he would. He wanted to get his revenge with his Dylan Brooks. Dropping 37 points, about eight rebounds, I believe, a couple assists. He was absolutely unstoppable. No matter what Dylan Brooks was doing towards him, it wasn't working. He was mocking him on the floor. And so this season alone, you know, LeBron turns 39 in a couple in a couple weeks. And he continues to let the lead know, I'm still that dude. I'm still him. So in today's video, we're going to be talking about how it should be illegal for the oldest player in the NBA to be hooping like this. What's good, y'all? It's your boy. We're back again with another video. And you think this video be was gonna be uh, me praising LeBron like I always do? I, actually, it's not. I'm gonna tell you what this video is gonna be about. Lakers. Why y'all giving LeBron so many minutes? Darvin Ham. I thought you was gonna put LeBron on a minutes restriction. Well, last night he played 40 minutes. The night before he played 35 minutes. And the night before that, in the game before that, he played 35 minutes. Where is his minutes restriction at? The least amount of minutes he's played this year is 23 minutes. And that's versus the Memphis Grizzlies. This got to stop. This The Lakers, y'all got to step up. There's no way in hell you should have a almost a 40-year-old man hooping like this on the floor. And for him to be in the most shape, he's he has been in absolute great shape. The best shape he has been out of all the other players on the team. That's sad. And I'm just talking directly to you, Anthony Davis. Anthony Davis, listen, you've been solid, but we know you're more than solid. You should be. If you had your A-plus game, you would be a top seven player in the NBA. But since you want to... Be inconsistent. And since you want to play the bare minimum, the most points you had this year is 30 points, three times. No more than that. Anthony Davis, you got to show why you should be the best player on the Lakers instead of LeBron. Because LeBron is, is old now. He's the oldest player in the NBA. He's still hooping like this. I'm worried for the Lakers. I'm worried because there's no way Y'all should let LeBron play like this. And then when playoff time comes, LeBron is going to be tired out because the rest of the team ain't doing nothing. The rest of the team ain't it's, it's playing bare minimum. It's playing inconsistent. D-Lo, you got to step up. Austin Reeves, you've been, you've been hooping better lately. 
but you got to step up even more. Cam Reddish, I actually like how, what I'm seeing from Cam Reddish. Rudy Hashimura, you got to be more consistent. And Torian Prince, you got to give better minutes. You're doing what you can, but I know you struggled last night. You got to get, you got to be more consistent. The rest of the team, y'all got to be more consistent to help out LeBron. LeBron's doing everything he can to stay consistent and stay with this team and stay, have this team in playoff contention and probably maybe like a contender. But I don't know if y'all could contender if it's just LeBron and AD and the rest of the team and, the, and just LeBron being the most consistent on this team. Lakers. Darby Ham, stop giving LeBron so many of these minutes. You're going to tire him out. When playoff time comes, you, it's going, you're going to feel sorry. And then we're going to have all the haters all talking about, oh, LeBron, LeBron not cush, LeBron not doing this, LeBron not doing that. Well, well, if you looked, if you watched the games in the start of the season or like the middle of the season, you'll see why now, right? Minutes restriction. Lakers, the rest of the team, y'all got to help LeBron out more. He, he's only one person. Yes, in my opinion, in my opinion, he's the greatest, but we're not going to get into that. we talking about the rest of this team because I'm already worried and the season just started. Minutes restriction, my butt. Can't keep... Having LeBron out in the room like this. Yes, he had a great performance last night, but y'all won by one point. It didn't now none of this wouldn't matter. This would be a whole nother conversation if Austin Reeves didn't make that shot. Then y'all be blaming LeBron for passing the ball in a crunch time. Lakers. There's no way y'all should be winning by one point versus the Houston Rockets. Even though they have improved, Dylan Brooks has been hooping on this team. Dylan Green's been doing his thing. I really like what I'm seeing for Sangoon. But Anthony Davis, you got to prove why you were the top seven player in the NBA. You got to prove that because right now, I mean, you put up numbers, but it's not really doing anything in my opinion. It really isn't. Now you playing amazing on defense, which you, you always been done. You always been doing is playing great on defense. But you gotta take that your game to the next level, and you gotta stay on the court. Can you please do the Anthony Davis? Keep hoping. You're doing fine. You need to do more to help LeBron now. You see what LeBron's doing at the age forty? Come on, come on, Lakers, come on. Win him at one point. I'm not really impressed by this win. LeBron had a great performance. We know what LeBron brings to the table. Cool. Rest of the team, y'all got to get together, man. That's all I got to say for this video. If y'all enjoyed, give me a like. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Give me to 400 subscribers. I appreciate y'all for the support. It's been your boy, Will, and I'm out.